Good afternoon from Chandigarh. I'm heading off to the Pinjor Gardens, which is located in the state of Haryana. I'm taking a direct rickshaw and it's going to take me all the way to the gardens. But you also have the option to take a shared rickshaw, which will help you save a little bit of money. Now, just to give you a brief idea, I took the rickshaw from Sukna Lake. And if you want to take a shared rickshaw, you can get off at this intersection here. This red circle is called as Panchkula. Another rickshaw will take you to this gardens. Shared rickshaws usually cost about 40 rupees each. Welcome to Pinjor Gardens. The only reason it's called Pinjor Garden is because this area is called as Pinjor. The real name of this garden is the Yada Vindra Gardens. So you get your ticket from there. That's the map. Twin. The entry is 25 rupees and here's a board, no mask, no entry. This is quite a big place. So that is a Sheesh Mahal. Sheesh means mirror or glass. This is a very tiny replica of the original Sheesh Mahal which is in Amer Fort in Jaipur, Rajasthan. If you haven't checked out that video, the link is on the top. Then you kind of come downstairs and that is what you call the Rang Mahal. The Pinjor Gardens were built by Muzaffar Hussain, who was also known as Fidai Khan. And he was the stepbrother or the foster brother of Aurangazeb, who was the son of Shah Jahan. Pinjor lies in the foothills of the Himalayas. So these gardens were like the summer retreat for the royal family. Although the exact construction date of this garden is not fully known, it is estimated it was built somewhere between 1775 to 1790. This garden is built in a similar style to the Shalimar Bagh in Kashmir and it has a total of 7 terraces with the main gate of the garden being the highest first terrace. After the Mughals, this garden was owned by the king of Patiala until the 19th century when the British took over and it is currently managed by the government of Haryana. Now they actually have a hotel and some restaurants in this garden here. One thing I realized is that the sun is right in front of the camera. So I should be able to get some really nice shots when I come back. So this garden is almost about uh, 200 meters that way.
that is about where the garden ends and uh, yeah there's a lot of uh, offbeat paths that you can take like maybe go around in a circle let's uh, try one of these ways i don't think it's gonna be that much interesting around this way this garden has a lot of colorful lights that they're gonna turn on after the sun goes down and it is open until 8 o'clock in the evening the last time to get your tickets is 7.30 Nothing around this place, just a little bit of stairs and uh, more ways around this place and uh, just some mango trees. That's about it. Let's go down the main way again. This is the Jal Mahal. Jal means water. It's got a little bit of a Rajasthani Mughal architecture to it. Now as I mentioned about the Sheesh Mahal before, the Jal Mahal is also located in the city of Jaipur in Rajasthan. So this is another one of those small palaces and uh, yeah right over there there are some more uh, restaurants and uh, there's public toilets out there. One more travel tip that I would like to give you is that this garden is only 15 minutes away from the Kalka railway station. So if you're ever going to Shimla and you are waiting for your train for a couple of hours I would definitely recommend you to take an auto or a bus come to this garden pay about 25 rupees spend a little bit of time you're also allowed to have lunch in this garden just make sure you don't throw any rubbish around and then you can head back to Shimla Now this is a prime example of what a 17th century Mughal garden looks like. That's one more bar and restaurant there. We are back to the Rang Mahal. The time is about 4.30 pm and it's a beautiful sunset out here.
is the way out and it's the exact same way that we came in from again Shish Mahal on the right that is a train locomotive from England probably from when the British were here outside there are some more restrooms if you want to use and also some games for kids I'll be heading back to Chandigarh because that is where I'll be staying tonight tomorrow morning I'm going to another city if you enjoyed this video please consider subscribing to the channel that was today's video of the Pinjor Gardens in Haryana thank you for watching see you next time bye bye